My name is Bradley Hounsman and I'm the owner of In Motion Sports Agency. Uh, the In Motion Sports Agency is an agency that represents emerging talent within the UK and, and further afield. Uh, we've got footballers that are playing up and down the country. It's been most recently just moved a player to Dubai um, for the UAE Pro League, which is obviously a growing market at the moment. Uh, and today we held a showcase event for talent across uh, Glasgow that we think is good enough to go and play over in America to do a scholarship or with further opportunities in the UAE. Um, so t today went really well. Uh, we're excited for the prospect of some of the candidates um, and we'll be reviewing that through the weeks as well once we've watched the footage back. Excellent, so what do the people taking part in the showcase game, what do they benefit from? Absolutely, so the next steps for everybody is myself and the team will actually watch the game back, um, analyse it a wee bit further and then we will sit down individually with each player that played and see what level we can maybe take that player to. Um, this, some of them, for instance, may be playing at a level in Scotland that we think there's just an extra step in that we can help facilitate. Um, so we'll, if that's the option that they've got here, then we'll definitely help them with it. And then with America, uh, some players were 15 years old here that want to go to America when they're 18. So our biggest advice for them is to start early because colleges in America, they recruit a couple of years in advance. Um, so our biggest thing for them is that start early, get get the tuition right so that your SAT score was of a certain level by the time you go over. Uh, we should already be talking to colleges years in advance for you as well because they know what certain spots are opening up on their roster in that year. Um, and it will allow for the biggest amount of funding to help for their scholarship as well. So um, our plan overall is when they come in with us, they get nutritional help, they get coaching in south side of Glasgow. They get uh, fitness coaching as well from Phoenix Fitness um, and they get a, a steady programme that will allow them for the best version of themselves by the time they go over for 18 years old. I think a, the, one of the biggest things as well is even just support for both the family and the player, that the family and the player know they've got somebody they can call seven days a week with any questions, any queries they may have about where their career is going to be end up in a couple of years time or where they're going to be studying. So that's one of the probably the biggest thing is our agency is a big support mechanism for all these players and the families. What do you hope today achieves for yourself and for the players? Absolutely, well we had 32 players playing today. Um, unfortunately not all of them will be successful in getting this, the opportunity of a scholarship. The reason being that uh, all these players could go to America and they could go to a level However, it has to be right for them. What we don't want to do is just take in players, offer everybody scholarships, and then unfortunately in six months' time, when they've been over there, they come back because they're not enjoying it. We've seen it happen many times before with other companies, unfortunately. They, they go out after six months and it's not the right setup for them, the education isn't great for them, and maybe even the wrong part of America that they don't enjoy. So they end up back in Glasgow with six months into their scholarship thinking, right, where do we go from here? So we're all very selective in who we bring on. Um, it has to be right for them, right for the family, and ultimately right for the college and the agency. So there's four or five moving parts there that has to fit everybody. So it won't be a 100% success rate that we ask everybody to have scholarships with us. However, there was a good percentage of players there that are good enough to go and make that step across to America. Others will help with, with their situation in Scotland and see what we can help with and one or two of them quite fancy going to Dubai so we've got opportunities as I say in the UAE Pro League that we'll be offering to these young players as well by the time they turn 18 they'll go across to Dubai. What makes you different from other agencies that say they so much so thank you? Of course especially with our um, American scholarship services uh, we are a lot different because we, it's a lot more personalised what can happen is that a lot of companies take American scholarships in in volume. So they bring the player in, have a day like today, a showcase event, have the footage, and they'll just put it on their website saying this player is available. And then all the colleges will start putting offers in. Now, unfortunately, that's suitable for the colleges, but it's not suitable for actually the individual. So what we do is we have an actual tailor, tailored program that fits that player that we sit down with them and say what part of America they're looking to go to, what they're trying to study, we know what level they should be going at, uh, we know what coaches are good for them as well. Um, so, so we then attack the schools rather than the schools attacking the player because it can end up a bit of a minefield for the player and the family that aren't, don't know that industry or that the levels of college as well. So we curtail all that for them and allow them the best opportunity that when they go out there, they go out there once and they only need to go to one college because they've got it from the start spot on. Rather than what can happen is you go out there 
and they haven't done their due diligence on the college, the coaches, team, teammates, whatever it may be. And then after six months, they come home or they either go to another college as well, which is can be a natural thing. It's just to go on the transfer portal and they go across to another college. But we want to go out there and have, when they go out, they go to one college and that's the college that they spend some, hopefully some incredible memories that over the course of the four years. And then they'll, they'll play their full-time football and they'll have a degree by the time that they leave and either further their football or go into uh, employment.